basically comes from the body. All the stars and the galaxy are inside of our body, and we use these outer planets and stars and galaxies to look inside of ourselves. But actually we're talking about our bodies, and we're using astrology as the language to help connect us to our spirituality, to our diet, to health, and to our history. We're going to look inside of the brain. In particular, we're looking at the inside of the third ventricle, uh, the brain, which is a fluid-filled space, and inside that fluid-filled space is the hypothalamus, and below there is the pineal gland. These are your brain cells blown up to about the size of a car. And below here is the pineal gland, and up above is floating this galaxy, as you would call it, celestial body. And it has little planets in it, it has a sun in it, it has moons, and they float and they have an orbit and it tilts, and it moves sort of like what you would call a uh, spaceship. Now I'm going to show you some of the movements of it. These are some of the movements of it. It has a swirling movement, a swirling movement here, and sometimes it develops a tail, and sometimes it moves clockwise and counterclockwise. In the lower picture here, you can see how it moves sideways, up, down, on various angles. And that is the anatomical third eye, or the celestial body within you, the galaxy within you, your celestial presence that announces you as part of the universe and the universe is part of you.